learn Mandarin with Chinese Pod, and you get、uh, excellent teachers in your pocket and great resources on the website. Hello, welcome once again to Chinese Pod, coming to you from Shanghai, China. We bring you lessons in spoken Mandarin. That is Mandarin as it is really spoken right here in China. Now we have、uh, four levels in our in our program, and today's lesson is from the very beginners、uh, stage,、uh, what we term newbies. And、uh, we have、uh, a dialogue for you in a moment. Now, if this stuff is too easy, don't worry. You can go and、uh, you can find some、uh, more more challenging dialogues depending on your level. So, my name is Ken, and with me is my name is Jenny. And Jenny is our wonderful teacher, our Chinese teacher. She's going to help us get through this dialogue. It'll be top down. We'll give you the dialogue、uh, in whole, and then you can start to try to figure it out. And we'll go through the details. Piece by piece, and with that, I do believe we could begin. Could we not, Jenny? Let's listen to the dialogue for three times. Great. First time. 你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号，在公园对面吗？是的。Second time. 你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号，在公园对面吗？是的。Third time. 你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号，在公园对面吗？是的。Okay, very good. Now I do believe it would be a good idea to translate sentence、yes. by sentence. Now, once again, we translate idiomatically. So at this stage, we don't go through the the details. So we just want to get the idea, the rough translation across details later. So Jenny, if you please. 你家里的地址是什么 ？What is your home address? 你家里的地址是什么 ？What is your home address? 你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号。My home address is. One hundred thirty-five Nanjing Road. 我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号。My home address is one hundred thirty-five Nanjing Road. 我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号。在公园对面吗 ？Is that in front of the park? 在公园对面吗 ？Is that across from the park? 在公园对面吗 ？Is it across from the park? 在公园对面吗？是的。Yes. 是的。Yes. 是的。Okay, good stuff. Now let's look in more details. We gave you the the, the overall translation. Ah,、uh, now 你家 right? 你家里 um how do you translate that? Uh. Essentially, it means your home, the place where you live. Yeah, the place where you live.、Yeah. Um, you can say 你家的地址 or 
你家里的地址。It's the same. Yeah. Okay. 地址 meaning、uh, address.、Mm. Yeah. Uh, could could we look at those two characters? 地址。好。地 fourth tone. Yes. 址 the third. Uh, 地 means the earth. Yes.、Right? Ground. 址 means uh position location. Okay.、Mm. So that's a really, really literal、yeah. translation. So it's like the spot on Earth, Earth spot. is your、yeah. address. Teacher, what is your Earth spot?、Um, interesting. Now, ni jali the teacher meaning、uh, the address, your home address.、Mm. Uh, now, shishama. In this case, we don't say where is it. You say what is your your home、yes. address? Okay. So one more time, please. You, what is your home address? Ni jali the teacher. 是什么 ？Good. And so the answer was. 我家里的地址。Okay, so 我家里的你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址。My home address is, 是 yes is 南京路一百三十五号。Okay, now 南京路。嗯。Now 路 meaning street, fourth town. Yes, and Nanjing Lu. Now, Nanjing Lu is perhaps the most famous street right here in Shanghai. Yeah, it's like Shanghai's on the Fifth Avenue.、Maybe? Kind of, yeah. So imagine you live there. Indeed,、oh, you live on Fifth Avenue. Gotta be pretty rich. Absolutely, Nanjing Lu. And then the number was. 一百三十五号。一百三十五号。嗯。Now, 号码 the the 号 meaning number. Yeah. And that's a、uh, fourth tone, right? Yes. So, 一百三十五号 So the、Number. way to remember、mm. is how is the fourth tone. Yeah, yeah. that's how you, you you get it. Uh, so number one hundred thirty five. Could you give us that again, please, Jenny? 一百三十五号 Good. Now, if it was one hundred forty five. 一百四十五号 One hundred fifty five. 一百五十五号 Um, actually, 我家里的地址是三百二十九号。Ah,、uh, your real home address. Yes. Okay. Can you say it again? 三百二十九号。三百二十九 meaning three hundred twenty-nine. Very good.、Mm. So, 我家里的地址是呃、uh, 是啊、uh, this name of the street, Nanjing Lu, 一百三十五号。Yes. So it's. My home address is number one three five, Nanjing Road.、Mm. Now the question was, 在公园对面吗 Okay. Now, 公园 meaning park. Yeah. Yeah.、Uh, 公 means sort of public, right? Yes. Public. 公共公共 meaning public. public yeah. Ah,、uh, and 园 meaning park or garden, garden yeah, or public garden. Public garden. Okay,、mm. so、uh, public garden is a park, indeed. 公园 and、uh, 对面对面对面、mm, means facing the yeah, opposite. Yeah, facing. Yes. Yeah, 对面啊、uh, meaning the opposite, facing across from, as we translate、yes. it. 对面啊、uh, ，if you're standing, you know, on this side of the road, and you ask where's the place, the guy might say, "It's at 对面、mm. right? It's over there. It's on the opposite、yes. side." And、uh, Ken and I, when we record the shows,、yeah. we actually sit 面对面,面,对面 face to face. Yes, indeed.、Mm. And、uh, so let's look at that、um, the, the the park again one more time, please. The the ah,、uh, so it's across from the park. 在公园对面吗？在公园对面吗、mm. ？So is it across from the park? Yes. And the answer? 是的。Very simple. Ah,、uh, so the person has a nice view. Absolutely. Yeah. Good. Now I think we could listen to that dialogue one more time, please. 你家里的地址是什么？我家里的地址是南京路一百三十五号，在公园对面吗？是的。
Okay, good stuff. Now, let's just uh, go through some of the vocab, the key yes. vocab we had in that lesson. Uh, now, the first one was uh, your home, the place where you live. 你家, 你家, or okay. 家里, 家里, okay. uh, address. 地址, 地址. Home address. 家里的地址. 家里的地址. Now, street. 路, 路. 135. 135. How? Number 135. Park. 公园. 公园. Across from. 对面. 对面. Excellent. Good stuff. Thank you once again, Jenny. Thank you. You're a wonderful student. Oh, yes. You're just saying that, though. You're a wonderful boss, oh, student, co-host. Oh, continue, continue. Multiple roles. <laughs> Excellent. Well, we hope you got a lot from that today, uh, from that uh, beginner's lesson. Yeah. Go to ChinesePod.com. You'll get much, much more. You can expand upon the stuff, explore the language, interact with other learners, and generally have a good time. Hopefully, you'll be back again to hear us tomorrow with another lesson for you. But right now, from Shanghai Chinese Pod, it's time for us to say, 再见! At Chinese Pod, we know what happens if you don't get your way. People die! Which is why we give you what you ask for. So if there's something that you'd like, visit the website and ask us. Hello, this is John from Hastings, and I was just wondering if you could do a show on exchanging mobile phone numbers. 请问你有没有手机? Could I ask if you have a mobile phone? Hi, this is May from New Zealand. Uh, I'd like to request a show on uh, finding an apartment. That'd be great, thanks. Today, we're going to talk about apartments, looking for apartments and finding apartments and so on. Hi, this is James from Savannah. Any chance of getting Jenny's phone number? Dream on. Visit the website ChinesePod.com and let us know. ChinesePod, where you can always get what you want.